Hi, my name is Chip and I'm a paramedic in the state of North Carolina. And I'm here today to talk a little bit about how you can treat someone that's having hypothermia, which is a cold emergency. Hypothermia is a result of the core body temperature going lower than what it should be. And when that happens, a lot of things can occur with the body. The patient can become confused, they can start to have slurred words, or if it's severe hypothermia, they can actually go unconscious. A couple things, if it's severe hypothermia, they've been caught in the, in the wilderness for a long time, they've been dropped into a cold body of water that's sub-freezing, then we need to make sure that we dry them off as soon as we can, get any wet clothing off, apply dry blankets, towels, things like that to help warm them back up. But at the same time, we don't want to move them very much. If we jar, drop, or shake the person that's in a severe hypothermic state, it can actually cause cardiac dysrhythmias, which simply put, uh, they can actually put the patient into a cardiac arrest or a situation where their heart would actually stop. So with that in mind, again, warm blankets and towels, try to keep them as warm as possible and dry. Don't jar them very much. Make sure you've initiated 911 and the ambulance is on the way. Individuals with hypothermia, especially severe hypothermia, will be in the hospital for quite some time to make sure they can recover slowly and not be warm too quickly, totally depending on what their core temperature is, which as a layperson, you can't really measure their core temperature. Uh, that's something the that EMS professionals and healthcare workers will do for you. My name is Chip, and this has been Basic Treatment for the layperson to take care of hypothermia.